Who was the key figure in fighting discrimination towards Alaska natives in the early 20th century? Today, we journey back in time to answer this question. Our story begins over a hundred years ago, in the small town of Petersburg, Alaska. The year is 1911, and a baby girl is born into a world that does not yet value her worth. Her name is Elizabeth Peretrovich. Elizabeth hails from a proud lineage of the Tlingit people, one of the indigenous groups of the Pacific Northwest. Her roots run deep in the rich cultural tapestry of Alaska, a tapestry woven with the resilience, strength and spirit of its native people. But the world she is born into is one of discrimination and prejudice, a world that fails to recognize the dignity and rights of her people. Born into a world of discrimination, Elizabeth Peratrovich was destined to challenge the status quo. Growing up in Alaska, Elizabeth Peratrovich experienced firsthand the harsh realities of discrimination. Born in 1911 in the small town of Petersburg, she was a proud member of the Tlingit community. From a young age, she bore witness to the rampant prejudice and discrimination that Alaska natives face daily. Life was a stark contrast of segregation, stripped of basic rights and filled with unspoken injustices. Everywhere she looked, Elizabeth saw the signs of this deeply embedded discrimination. It was in the schools where Alaska natives were treated as second-class citizens, and in the towns where they were denied access to certain areas because of their heritage. But rather than succumb to this injustice, Elizabeth was galvanized. She saw the need for change and felt a deep driving desire to be a part of that change. It was these early encounters with discrimination that shaped her resolve to fight for justice. These experiences lit a fire within Elizabeth, fueling her commitment to fight for the rights of Alaska natives. In 1945, Elizabeth Peratrovich took a stand that would change the course of history. In the frosty halls of the Alaska Territorial Legislature, Peratrovich stood tall and firm, her voice echoing the cries for justice and equality that had long been silenced. She was there to advocate for the Anti-Discrimination Act, a piece of legislation that promised to outlaw discrimination based on race in Alaska. Imagine the scene, a woman of Tlingit heritage standing in front of a room full of legislators, many of whom had been oblivious to the plight of Alaska natives. Peratrovich spoke with an eloquence that captured the attention of all in attendance. Her words were not just a plea, but a powerful call to action, a demand for justice and a testament to the resilience of her people. She painted a vivid picture of the prejudice faced by Alaska natives, the pain of segregation, and the burning desire for equality. Her speech was marked by a profound understanding of the human condition, a plea for empathy, and a demand for justice. It was a speech that would resonate within those halls long after she had finished speaking. And the impact of her words? It was nothing short of monumental. The Anti-Discrimination Act was passed, marking a significant victory for Alaska natives and a step forward in the fight against racial discrimination. Peretrovich's eloquence and passion moved legislators, leading to a landmark victory in the fight against racial discrimination. Elizabeth Peratrovich's fight for justice left an indelible mark on history. Her tenacious spirit and unyielding dedication to civil rights carved a path toward equality for Alaska natives, and indeed all Americans. Born from her courage, the Anti-Discrimination Act of 1945 stands as a testament to her legacy, a beacon of hope in a world often marred by prejudice and discrimination. Every year, on the 16th of February, Alaska stops to remember and celebrate Elizabeth Peratrovich. This day, known as Elizabeth Peratrovich Day, is not just a celebration of one woman and her achievements, but an acknowledgement of the ongoing struggle for equality. It's a day that calls us to remember the injustices of the past, to appreciate the progress made, and to recognize the work still ahead of us. On Elizabeth Peratrovich Day, we pay homage to a woman whose life was dedicated to justice, who stood up for her people, and who refused to back down in the face of adversity. We honor her strength, her courage, and her unwavering belief in the power of change. As we commemorate Elizabeth Peratrovich, we are reminded of the importance of standing up against discrimination, of using our voices to effect change, and of the power that lies within each of us to shape a more equitable world. Elizabeth Peratrovich Day serves as a poignant reminder of our collective responsibility to speak out against discrimination in all its forms. Her legacy continues to inspire us today.